aqui estamos nós de novo para mais uma sessão de Honkai Ron Star Rail. Quase falei outro jogo aqui no meio do processo, mas é pra... Opa, botou errado. É assim. <risos> pegar minha recompensa diária. Eu não recompensa diária, tem que pegar do céu. Mas enfim, a última, vez que, a última coisa que a gente tava falando, eu tava fazendo era ir falar com... A Natasha, mas vi uma, uma mensagem aqui do Pompom. Bom, a gente acabou de falar, pô. Vamos falar com o Pompom aqui rapidinho. Depois a gente continua né? Deixa eu me avisar pra poder sair do lugar que eu. Ah! Check in diário do Honka. É, a única coisa que mandou foi sua opinião de, sobre isso. Cara, sei se ela põe ele pra. Back already? Did you get it? Ah, como é que tá meu level do. Do, do Blazer? O outro. Isso. 13. Aí, nível 13. Hum. Agora a gente pode ir aqui. Navegação. Ele pode estar pra cá, eu não posso ter pra cá. Aham. Isso daqui é só... Ah tá, é coisa pra usar... Só pra ter que ver como é que vai pra usar item na batalha. Eu vou dizer que é mais sentido usar em batalha do que usar fora da batalha. E agora sim a gente pode falar com a Natasha. Pra minha. Não, bem resumo. Bem resumo não. Eu não tenho beleza pra ela, tá cheio. Como você está se sentindo? Algum aches ou pains? Não, tá sussa. Você estava fora por um tempo. Eu estava começando a se preocupar. Você estava dizendo algumas coisas estranhas. Bem, agora que você está acordado, você deveria provavelmente tentar mover suas limbs. Eu sou a Natasha, uma doutora no underground. You've already spent a day in my clinic. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm afraid the conditions underground are terrible. People get sick easily here, and I'm the only doctor. Sampo's gone to clear up a mess of his own making. So I'm looking after you in the meantime. Based on your current state, I don't think there's any cause for alarm. You seem perfectly healthy. So, if you don't mind, I'll go and take a look at the other patients. Uh, I think they just told me that you lost consciousness. He didn't say why. Still, I'll be sure it had something to do with him. He's always tinkering with his devices. Anyway, the opinion of the clinic is that none of you have come to harm. Uh, oh, please, you needn't worry. You've just been asleep for a while. I barely had to lift a finger. I might have exaggerated your condition for Sampo's years. But that guy owes me. He better bring me back some medicine. Uh, Don't worry. The Silvermane guards won't follow you below ground. We've been cut off from the surface for many years. 
Even when things were at their worst down here, they never showed. Of course, I don't know the whole story behind why the architects ordered the lockdown. Who knows? Thanks to you, they might finally be about to lift it. Something that wildfires wanted to achieve for a long time now. They've been up for a while already. The young guy with the dark hair left first. He went with Sampo. Your rowdier friend took off soon after waking up. I imagine she's taking a stroll nearby. As for the girl in the silver main guard uniform, I told Sampo to watch her, but it seems that he left his post and she made a run for it. Uh, kind of something. Good question. <laughs> He's a man of mystery. He claims to be a simple cross-border businessman. Not that there's much to interest an overworlder down here. Either way, he's got a surprising number of connections. I've managed to secure more than a few urgent medical supplies through him, and he's been a big help to Wildfire. In any case, I don't think his intentions are sinister. Oh. It's a grassroots organization. Think of it as the Silver Main Guards of the Underground, but less stone hearted. Well, no. <laughs> no need to thank me. It's a doctor's duty to heal. I gotta find March 7th in Dan Hung. But where should I start? Primeiro, I should go side the keeper and see if I can find the bottom. Achamos. Achei a marcha. Antes de falar com a marcha, vamos. Era lixeira. A outra lixeira. Olha o tombal. Eu que ter jogado doente por muito tempo me acaba me quebrando na hora que eu vou correr com esse, esse jogo. E no Genshin eu, eu tenho que apertar e segurar o correr. Fala ah, moleque, o que, que tem aí? Uh, rapaz, o que que é esse torneio? O <risos> clube da luta. Como é que eu preciso do, do convite pro clube da luta? Não sei. Ah, tô fechado. Outro bom. Vou pegar uns documentos aqui. Opa, tem outro aqui. Lixeira tem o que? Uh, quantas lixeiras tem? 20. Uh, 7. Ah, eu vou abrir. Você está tentando parar? Eu não paro. Ha. Aqui é a saída.
Então a porta aqui. Uma sala barata, não chegou. Tá. Foi bom, foi bom, foi bom. O chá foi bom, o chá foi bom, o chá foi bom. A recepção depois não foi boa. Oh, está ótima. Estou feliz com esse excelente serviço. Ah. Nameless. Tá tranquilo. Eu acredito que isso aqui fez algum sentido pra mim, né? Looks good. Vamos ver. Só lixeira. Ah, ah. normais. Ah. Deixa eu ver não. Ok, não está disponível essa área. O que tem aqui? Ah. O que você está que que vendendo aí? Também vende artefato. É só uma vez que eu. Legal. É mil, eu tenho 600. Aí eu tinha ido pra lá, ok. Então vamos por aqui. Outra loja. O que você tem pra nós aí? Vou tomar música. E comer. Mas fala aí, o que é esse torneio de comida? Tô pronto. Vamos lá. Uh. Ah, me chame uh, do caranguejo mordedor, mano. Uh. <risos> mordeu. 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 Eu tinha um mordido. Oh. Caranguejo. Vitória. Ai, mano. Vou vencer, rapaz. Ah. Ah. Não dá pra clicar aqui. Opa, tem outro baú ali. Looks good. Essa lixeira. Eu vou abrir. Nada. 
Let's see the shit up. Oh, I hope. Whoa. Let's go to this. Não dá pra subir aqui, não? Não dá pra subir aqui, não. Mais um baú aqui. Looks good. Ah, acabou pra abrir todos os baús. Ah, como é que tá isso daqui? É. Deixa eu ver. Oi? Uh, okay, 740. Mysterious. You took for Opa, my delicious. Uh, you're up. Ew. What? So, oh, my that if I win hide and seek, you'll tell Big Sister March all the ins and outs. Yep, all the ins and outs. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> it just means you'll tell me all the details. No hiding anything and no telling fibs. <laughs> Hook is in an overgrounder, you know. Hook never tells fibs. Yeah, never. Well, that's settled then. Okay, let's play. Huh? You, uh, when did you get here? Hmm. No, no, no. No, no, no. Quit acting like a child. <laughs> it's like this. After I woke up, that doctor said Sampo had taken Don Hong with him. I went around in circles trying to find the blue-haired scoundrel and bumped into these kids. They say they know where he is. But they said I had to join the moles or something if I wanted to find out. And to do that, I had to prove my strength by winning a game of hide-and-seek. Do you get it? Mm. What's that? Okay. She play too? Um, okay. Two. I guess so. Then you guys are seeking. Boss, they don't seem very smart. Why don't we do a practice one first? Mm, you're right, Julian. Okay, let's do a practice one. I'll hide. You two have to find me. So, you kids think you're better than us, huh? Just you wait and see. It's simple. When you see one of them, you just have to catch them. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, cool, cool. Look, what's that? What's that? Gotcha. Pronto. Pronto, não, aí eu vou. Aí, Hulk, você ferrou. <risos>
I'm not afraid. What are they feeding you kids down here? Eu preciso mesmo procurar o Red, já achei a principal. Uh, uh, Tampinha 2, localizado. Ok, me fala aí. Ah. Tampinha três, tampinha três. Something's not right. That guy's been staring at us this whole time. Hide and seek might have to wait. Let's see what he wants. Ah, oh, boa, Márcio. Vou, 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 vou procurar terceiro. Ah, tá bom. Tá bom. Tá bom. are telling me something's not right with this guy but uh... hey. <laughs> nonsense <clears throat> how many eight-year-olds do you see walking around that look like this huh All right, the jig is up. Your voice gave it away. But I'm Julian of a thousand faces. Why did you have to talk to me? My reputation is ruined. What will the boss think? No need for the melodrama. That was still a magical performance. I... <sighs> I'm sorry, boss. I failed. Darn! How did you see through Julian's disguise? What villainy is this? <laughs> Those with keen eyes see the dust between the stars. I came up with that, by the way. Ah, uh, yeah. You're in the footnote somewhere. So, Hitch Dark Hook the Great. You can tell us now, right? Uh, yes. The boss of the moles is true to her word. Look, so the blue haired guy take your dark haired friend to the fight club. The fight club? Ubi de luta? Oh, pera, eu pensei que a primeira regra era. Talk about it. Is this more secret talk? Uh, Pitch Dark Hook the Great. Where is the Fight Club? Can you show us the way? Hmm. But it's an obvious building. Grown-ups are just useless. Come with Hook, I'll take you over. Thanks, oh great one. That's Pitch Dark Hook the Great to you. Who said you could shorten my title? A club just for fighting. Who knew undergrounders had such brutal hobbies? Uh -huh. In fact, it's awesome! They let you take part? When did this place last have an inspection? We're here! This is it! A cook's gonna go fight. See you later! Who's in charge here? How can they just let kids attack each other? The moles are in charge, that too, but only the kids. Wildfire's in charge of grown-ups. Yeah, but there's something else here for me to examine. The moles control everything underground. Ooh, they need one more player there. I, I gotta go. If you ever want to fight, come find me. Já é. Ah, nível 14. Peraí, deixa eu examinar aqui. Looking for a ticket? Oh, 
A gente não, eu não vi nada do seu coração baixinho. Para no pudão. Brothers and sisters, are you ready for today's most spectacular, spine-tingling, earth-shattering contest? On one side, recommended by tall, blue, and handsome, the unsmiling. Pulverizing power, the new him. kid on the block, Cold Dragon Young, and his opponent is none other than the unfeeling, incendiary, explosive might of Team Robomatic. All praise to Boss Faron. Given that no other fighter was willing to take on the strength of Team Robomatic, Cold Dragon Young will face off against these opponents alone. On learning his fate, the brave young fighter had one thing to say, whatever. And so, let the semifinals of the 1758th Fighting King Challenge begin. Quick, let's help him. Oh, brothers and sisters, an unexpected turn of events. Two members of the audience have charged into the octagon. It looks like they want to team up with Cold Dragon Young. <sighs> so you're awake. Yeah, the first thing we did was go look for you. And now that we found you, we're trying to make sure you don't get your butt kicked. You're welcome. Brothers and sisters, you can feel their passion. The magnetic pull of this electric sport is undeniable. But let me reiterate, these competitions are for professionals only. Whatever you do, kids, don't try this at home. And Cold Dragon Young is signaling that the contest will go ahead. He's just itching to get into it. And so are we. It's the Iron Fist of Cold Dragon Young and friends versus the Iron Skin of Team Robomatic. I can take them on my own, you know. Oh, we need to work on your emotional intelligence. Let's go to casa. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. what a beautiful performance! Cold Dragon Young and his last minute admirers emerge victorious! Admirers? How come we don't get cool nicknames? Melhor do que o Code Dragonhão não tem. I think our taste in nicknames is different. Hey, look, it's Sampo. Uh... A gente tem uma outra bunda pra chutar. Aqui. É meu agora, né? Ah, até agora um convite pro.